morning. Thanks so much for joining us. Lee McHugh, Keith Yandel, Anson Carter, who is drinking some sort of green concoction on St. Patrick's Day. Craig Berube is here. Vincent, listen, you're in a push for the playoffs here, trying to climb the ladder, maybe top seed in the Eastern Conference, and every game matters. But do you still get up? Do you still get a little more juice when it's the Islanders that come visit your building? Yeah, I think so. I mean, we, we went a whole year without playing these guys until the outdoor game. Um, me getting used to the rivalry being in New York, it's uh, it's definitely something. I mean, you come into MSG, there's, there's uh, fans on both sides. It's loud. Uh, it means a lot to this city, so you definitely feel it. Vincent, it's uh, Yance here. Uh, just amazing what you guys have done on back-to-backs. 11-1 and one on the uh, second end of the back-to-backs. What do you credit that to, besides your mustache? <laughs> <laughs> um, first and foremost, the mustache. But after that, I'd say I think it's just preparation. Um, a lot of times, it's tough to get up for that second game. Um, and I think a lot of it comes down to just the system that we're playing playing smart defensively and, and just being ready to play kind of a mucky game. Charles Chase, don't listen to Yans. I love the stash. Looks unbelievable. But I want you to talk about your line mate, the bread man, like Temi Panarin. What's it like playing with him? Every single game he seems to be doing something special. You've been the recipient of some tremendous passes from number 10. Yeah, he's a special player. Obviously, everybody knows that. He's um, He's been kind of dominating this league for a while now. And even last year, coming here for the first time, being on his line, it was... Um, it was special to play with him. I mean, it, it's so easy. He, he does so many things well. He draws the attention of the, of the defenders every time he's on the ice. But um, I was actually telling Yan the other day, he somehow managed to take another step this year. He he just goes above and beyond. It's his work ethic. He does it every day in practice. Um, and yeah, I mean, I don't know what else I could say. Go on and on about him. He's, he's a phenomenal hockey player. All right, it's St. Patty's Day. You got a lot of time on the rest of the day. Any big plans? And do they involve Darren Bang? I don't know if you saw him dressed like a leprechaun in the middle of your game. Yeah, he was crouching down. I don't think he needed to, though. <laughs> <laughs> I got no plan. I'm going to sleep. <laughs> All right, excellent final shot. Thanks so much for joining us. Really appreciate it. Congrats. Great game today. Thanks, boys. Thanks, man. <laughs>